Hi, I'm Marilyn Badger and I am so excited to be here in Fall Quilt Week Paducah and share my quilts that I have done over my 27 year long arm career. It starts from the very beginning, the first quilt that I did, to up to the very last one that came off my machine. Uh, and there are several ones that are really special to me. I'd like to share a few of them with you. The one behind me is called Bally High and it is one of my solitaire quilts. A lot of the quilts in the exhibit are collaborative quilts with Claudia Clark Myers of Duluth, Minnesota. And this one happens to be her pattern, but I did it, uh, quilted it and pieced it myself. And it features a technique that I call overlay quilting. Uh, I kind of came up with that idea in 2009, and it means that I just do a design over the piecing that, that it becomes a third element to the quilt. So this quilt has 16,000 yards of metallic thread stitched into the top, and it took me about nine months to complete. So this quilt is called Almost Cruel, and it is my very first competition piece. And I, I, it's just so simple, it's amazing to me how it ever did anything, but that's how much long arm quilting has changed over the years. This quilt is exuberance and it's a very sentimental quilt to me. I uh, worked on the top in, the, in terms of the piecing applique and all while I was sitting and taking care of my husband in his final months. And he was able to see the top completed and absolutely loved it, said it was his favorite and he named it exuberance. Uh, when I finally got to where I could quilt it, I entered it at AQS, the first AQS Chattanooga show and it won best of show. And the ribbon that went with it was that exact purple right there in the quilt. So I know he was up there looking down and smiling. Then this little quilt is a, a little thread portrait. It's a picture that I took of him on our first year together. And I went to a Silomar and took a class from Pam Holland. And I began stitching on his eyes on what would have been our 40th anniversary. And it was so therapeutic. I walked on the beach. It was, and it was just a wonderful week and a great way of healing. This quilt is called Dragon's Breath, and it was a collaborative quilt with Claudia Clark Myers, her original design. Uh, it was done in 2008, and it was the first quilt that we used actually paint that was made for fabric. And uh, basically the whole quilt is this piece of peach fabric, and everything else you see on here, with the exception of the four corners, are, is my quilting that I quilted, and then she painted it. So it looks like applique. It kind, of, it kind of was the beginning of a breaking a barrier for paint on quilts. And we entered it in the AQS Des Moines show. I think it was the first AQS Des Moines show and it won the best long arm award. And now we come to the most recent quilt that I have finished. It was done in 2017. It's called Pinball Wizard. It's an original design and I drafted these little uh, shooting stars in a class uh, done by Gail Garber, who taught us how to do that drafting. And when I got it all put together, someone told me it looked like a pinball machine, so that's why I named it Pinball Wizard, and it's embellished to death. <laughs> Thank you so much for enjoying me here. It was such an honor to display my quilts and be able to talk about my long arm career.